Just want to do a quick video on my uh, PETG or PETG uh, settings for Simplify 3D for the Mono Price Maker Ultimate 3D printer. So these pr uh, settings I have here, I want to scroll through the menus. I'm not really going to talk about all of them, but just wanted to scroll through. Uh, so if anyone else is having a problem printing PETG like I was, um, these are the settings that have uh, been pretty successful for me. Um, the only mods I have is a glass plate uh, or a glass build plate uh, that I build on. Um, uh, but other than that, no special fan or anything like that. I had the default fan uh, on there. Now I'm, I am printing. Uh, that's one of the pieces that's behind here that I'm that I've got up here. Is I am working on printing a uh, fan uh, mod, but it's not currently on right now. So here is my uh, extruder uh, panel here and all my settings. My layer settings. Uh, the additions, like all of mine, uh, I usually use a skirt um, in order to make it uh, stick to the build, uh, the glass plate, uh, the glass build plate uh, better. Um, and then we're going to go, you know, that's our infill settings, nothing special there. Support settings, nothing special there. Uh, temperature, so I'm running the build plate at 75. Uh, and the extruder at 235. Cooling. Um, nothing, I don't think you have to do anything special here, um, but uh, uh, I have changed my cooling just a little bit to help it stick to the build play a little bit more, a little bit better. Um, in the end, if you're having problems sticking to the glass plate, you can go back and look at my earlier video where I post on how to get it to stick to a glass build plate. Um, I find that every now and again I just have trouble with something sticking to it. Uh, so I will use that wood glue solution that uh, I showed in an earlier video. But for the most part it normally sticks without that. Uh, G code. Script. And once here on the script here, you can go back to an older video that I made that uh, posted the uh, end and beginning G codes. Other, I do print PET G a little bit slower at 40 mill millimeters per second. So that is uh, pretty much all of my settings for PET G. I just I had a time getting mine to print and these are the ones that I've come up with successfully work um, right here so hope this is helpful in some form or fashion um, once you know these are not all end all be all uh, settings um, but I think it will be a good uh, foundation to start upon thank you